So, what happened to the Mars colony? In the year 2022, SpaceX launched its first PFR to the red planet Mars. Following the success of the first launch, another PFR was sent shortly after. Each rocket could carry 50 people, but only 8 carefully selected crew members were sent to colonize Mars. The first PFR contained two life support modules for the 8 crew members, while the second contained a command module for communication. The goal was simple, to build a permanent colony to sustain life in the planet. With the success of the mission, they then proceeded with the next plan for the colony to expand the settlement and to bring more people to the planet. Two years later, four more BFR was sent for the expansion of the Mars colony. This time, they would carry only six crew members. It was initially planned that only four members were going but they changed their mind and claimed that they would need more crew as the base expands. This was the final plan to expand the settlement. The rockets would carry two telescopes, an observatory tool, a laboratory, a greenhouse, and a power room, along with a rover and a helicopter. At least a year has passed since the first launch, and the crew members have reported that at least one of the scientists was suffering from an illness. They have never thought it would be from radiation, because their suits can withstand high radiation levels. This was not disclosed to the public, and was kept amongst the crew members. Soon after the second launch, they have tried a medication that were sent, but none of them worked. This resulted in the death of one of the colonists and the exact cause of his death is still unknown. They had planned to send the body back to Earth for further examination, but there lies another problem. The process of turning frozen water caps to methane for fuel was harder and almost impossible. Out of the six BFR on Mars, none of them have returned to Earth. People have started to notice this, but they are yet to see a BFR to come back. The first year in the colony, went well according to the colonies. But as time passed, more crew members have gotten ill. During the search for the cause, the crew have found that the spacesuits are not able to withstand long periods of exposure to radiation. The realization was too late. The damage has been done. It is only a matter of time until all of them become sick. Concerned for their lives, some of the crew members decided to leave and so the crew members split up 
into two groups, those who wish to leave and those who wish to stay. With the remaining fuel left on the rockets, they siphoned what's left to fill up a ship to leave for Earth, and thus the colonists part ways. They have overlooked many risks, and they have come to part them. one thing left to do, to abandon the colony and to rescue the remaining colonists. Sometime later, SpaceX announced their rescue rocket, the Starship. The BFR ran out of fuel before it would reach the Earth's gravitational pull. They entered inside the rocket, only to find dead bodies of the crew members. the whole area, in the vicinity of the colony, to look for signs of life, but there was none, only debris of the ruined colony. 